Hello everyone, welcome back. In this video, let's see how to use glide path to achieve BPO SLA or KPA target. So we have a situation where we need to meet the minimum 91% quality target. So in this table, we have the details of team member, their fair audit quality percentage that is from team member 1 to, to team member 10. So here is a quality percentage, team member 1 achieved 100%, 2 100%, from team member 3 to team member 10, they are not meeting the minimum target of 99%. So due to this, the overall quality percentage, it is 97.37, it means we have a scope of more than 1.5% to increase to meet the 99% quality. By using this glide path, we can understand for each team member on a daily basis what is the quality percentage they need to achieve so that from day 1 to day 15, after end of day 15, they will be at 99%. So I have used the formula quarant, uh, quartile to, uh, to make it group, uh, to make four groups, that is group 1, 2, 3, 4. So for this, let's go through this formula quarantile.inc and then the array is the quality percentage of all the team members that is team members 1 to team member 10 then I have used 0 here 0 means minimum value and 1 is first quartile that is 25% 2 is like median 50% 3 is third quartile 75% so let me use 0 here close bracket press center and you have 94.7% and that is the minimum or the least quality percentage achieved by team member likewise for group 2 uh, instead of 0 we have taken 1 that is 25% for 3 group 3 we have taken 2 and group 4 we have taken 3 so now we have the quartile percentage and now we need to uh, group these team members in which group they will fall. Group 1, uh, the team member 10 will fall in group 1, to member 9 to team member 7, they fall in team member group 2, uh, team member 6 will fall in group 3 and team member 4, uh, team member 5 to team member 3, they fall in group 4. Uh, team member 1 and 2, they don't fall any here because they already achieved 100%. Now, number of days, we have 15. Uh, that's the target. By end of 15th day, they should be at 99%. And then, we need to calculate for each day what is the quality percentage they should increase so that by end of day 15, they have 19%. For that, we need to take this quartile percentage minus uh, sorry it is uh, the quality percentage the minimum what we need to target minus the quartile percentage divided by number of days that is 15 so likewise if you see here for this again the quality percentage group to quartile percentage divided by 15 so we have the improvement per day improvement percentage per day now for day one the formula will be the quartile percentage of group 1 plus the day each day the improvement percentage likewise for day 2 the previous day plus each day performance like th day 3 previous day quality percentage plus each day quality percentage likewise if you calculate by end of day 15 you see it is 19 percent likewise for the group 5 you see uh, it starts from uh, 95.89 on day 1 and you, it will be keep increasing until it will be 99 for day 5. So likewise we can calculate for each group what is the quality percentage they need to achieve from day 1 to day 15 so that by end of the day 15 they are at 19%. Now we have the actual target here uh, by day wise. Now we can uh, plot the achieved target on each day for example now group 1 team members on day 1 they need to ensure they achieve at 95.02 and you can start making a note for each day what is the quality percentage each team members each group are achieving and if you see there is a reduction we need to uh, 
uh, speak to your team members to ensure where they are going wrong to ensure that we are increasing or we are going as per the target likewise on a day on a daily basis for each group you can start capturing to ensure so that we can uh, by end of day 15 we are at 99 percent target i hope this video is useful if you like this video please click on like button to subscribe to my channel and also you can download this video or excel file from the description provided in the link below thank you